crank it to 11 as we find out what's trending on 2 News today. What do you say we start with a viral photo taken at an Ohio doggy daycare showing some rather pretty impressive squad goals. I love this one. Mm. The workers at GoFetch, a dog daycare and boarding in Loveland, shared what appears to be a <laughs> selfie. Is selfie in there? <laughs> I know. I, mm. I, he, he should take part in this. Yeah. Look at that front <laughs> dog. <laughs> it features Rogue, a rescue okay. Labrador mix. And a bunch of his pals with the caption, a bunch of goofballs. Mm -hmm. The photo has received close to 2,000 reactions on Facebook. Only 2,000? <laughs> well, hopefully we can get that number up there. You Do you know? know what that reminds me of? <laughs> Ellen's famous uh, oh, yeah. selfie um, that she took at, at the, the Oscars. Emmys or Oscars. Oscars, yeah. yeah. Okay. It's pretty cool there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, something else going viral. A maternity shoot after a mom <laughs> embraces her pregnancy craving. Yeah, I can dig this one. A Florida <laughs> mom expecting her second little boy. But what she wasn't expecting was for her photo shoot to go viral. <laughs> You'll see, and this is why it went viral, right? Uh, Bree Bradford um, says that she craved Chick fil A so much during her pregnancy oh that she goodness. and her sister Haley, who's a photographer, then decided to include the restaurant's popular food <laughs> items in Bree's maternity photo shoot. <laughs> Uh, by the way, this is uh, Bree's second child and her second boy. The maternity photos have gone viral on social media. I, I, need I to, can see why. I need to know part two of this one because part two has <laughs> got to be like free oh, food from Chick-fil-A. Oh, that little nugget. Oh, that's cute. Yeah, she's going to have a big nugget there in a few months. Uh, go ahead today, by the way, if you need permission. Mm -hmm. Indulge in your sweet tooth. This is a national day that we can both enjoy. Yes. Chocolate chip day. Yes, mm -hmm. and I've actually already indulged today oh, that's a piece good. of cake. Well, so, you know, oh, healthy eating. That was good, by the healthy way. Healthy eating is yeah. not happening today. Chocolate chip cookies are credited to Ruth Graves Wakefield. Hmm. Thank you. The Massachusetts woman was a Toll House Inn employee in 1937 when one day she decided to put up choc chopped up pieces from a Nestle chocolate bar. And a cookie recipe. Mm. That's how they came about. The chocolate chip cookies were a hit, obviously. Duh. And Wakefield inked a deal with Nestle. Uh. She gave the company her recipe, and then they gave her chocolate for life. She got ripped off. <laughs> yeah, I think so, too. Chocolate chips were originally semi-sweet. Now they come in a variety of flavors, including mint, white chocolate, and bittersweet. Oh, man, there's got to be some royalties there somewhere. Yeah, right, she got totally, I know. She got jobbed. <laughs> uh, tell us how you're planning on celebrating the royal wedding. Are you Going to do, how about maybe with some chocolate <laughs> with, chips? Yeah, or yeah. some cake. I, I, you know. I, 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 want, I want to know uh, what, what other goodies you put in a chocolate chip cookie. Because some people like to spice it up a little mm -hmm. bit. Let us know. WDTN.com or our Facebook page. Whatever you want to tell us, just tell us. We'll listen.